welcome back. I just want to on record right now that I do not need a man whatsoever. I just moved this heavy freaking box all the way up the stairs by myself, all the way in here, took our mattress off our bed by myself because that is a new mattress. And I asked Brad to do this like a week ago and he didn't do it. So I'm getting things done by myself today. So I'm going to attempt to put this on our bed, but if I can get up here, I can get on the bed. So that is what we're doing right now. And I hope it's comfy. It is from Molecule. It's an early Christmas gift from my mom and stepdad. So thank you, mommy, for getting us a new mattress. It's one of the ones that like expand, obviously. And yeah, and that's not our address, by the way. This um, was purchased at an auction. It's fine. Phelps uses this. Cool, cool, cool. Um, hmm. Temperature regulation. Huh. Cool. I think it's like a memory foam type thing. Oh, this is not directions. Okay, I'm pretty sure it's just self-explanatory. Perfect. Okay, let's go try to put it on the bed. sweating so much but now I don't know how I'm gonna get that down the stairs by myself so I might need a man for that one actually not a man just another person and the person that lives with me happens to be a man so it is what it is I'm gonna make some lunch really quick um it's like what time is it two it's like two something um, and I had two campaigns that I had to submit to be approved this morning. So I was just doing that kind of thing all morning. Like I get it when brands want stuff approved, but it's kind of like, I don't know, like they asked you to do something creatively. And so I feel like it like puts a damper on your creativity to give so many restrictions, which is your creativity is why they hire you in the first place. So I do get it because like they want like what they're paying for, but I don't know, just a little food for thought 
um yeah and usually it does get approved like it's usually not a huge deal but i don't know just like a thought that i had the other day like don't they want us to like do our own thing and be creative but whatever it is what it is um so yeah i'm gonna make a tofurkey sandwich the best sandwich in the world and then literally that's all i have to eat like i'm glad that's what i want it um then i need to go to the grocery store and my makeup looks really good today and it's sunny for once so i'm gonna shoot some photos and yeah that is what we're gonna be doing and sorry if you can hear the washer i'm washing the sheets so i can have a fresh bedtime experience tonight i'm going to like wear like i don't know i don't even have matching pajamas that's what i was gonna say but like maybe something that matches and like go to bed with some tea i'm gonna really like soak in the new mattress which is stunning amazing i'll link it down below if you want to get one um it's from the brand molecule and it's bomb so yeah i'm gonna make my sandwich and try to figure out what i want to shoot in so can i show you guys this chuggy monstrosity of a water bottle a brand sent it to me so i usually want to be rude and say it's chuggy but let's be honest it is but it's not as described, so I am I like refuse to talk about it because like it's not what I place the order as. And there's like another one too they sent me and it's like wild. I'm not even gonna do it because like I don't need to be a hater, it's fine. Like it's like an Amazon brand, but I actually have been using this water bottle to drink all my water and I see why people use them because it's efficient. What stops me from drinking all my water for the day is having to refill it. And when I have this, I don't have to refill it because it's a big boy. And this one is pretty cute, but if you would have seen like the picture that was supposed to come, you would, you would understand what I'm saying. So that's why I'm even saying that. Like, of course I'm grateful that they wanted to send me something, but I just think it's funny that it's just like not what, what was advertised. So it's all good. I'm still gonna use it. Why waste a perfectly good water bottle? And yeah, so I just wanted to share, I'll link some that like actually I know are as described. Like this wasn't in the photo, like the colors are off, like it's just all different. And the one the other color is like completely different font, like it's something. And like the ombre is like, it looks like someone just like dipped it in like paint. It's real, real weird. But yeah, so I've been getting all my water in. Because I don't take this to the gym, and that's embarrassing to me. Because, um, like, I go to Orange Theory, and it's not like I'm, like, going to, like, free weights. It's, like, a class where, like, I'm rotating, and there's not that much room. So I do take this, the Yeti, um, so it fits, like, in the cup holder on the treadmill and stuff. And then, so I drink two of those usually. So that's 64 ounces. And then I come home and drink 128 ounces, which I do put ice in it. So we're accounting for that. But, like, that's pretty freaking good. That's like over a gallon of water a day and I've been really consistent. So as ugly and tacky as these are, I mean, they honestly like are doing a good job. So, okay, I'm really chatty today. So I'm gonna go, I'll see you guys in a second. Okay, here it is. So this is like the hickory smoked tofurkey. Usually I'd put vegan mayo on it. Um, I'm out, need to go to the store. Usually I'd put spinach on it. Our spinach is bad. So and then it's avocado onion and then the most important part is the balsamic glaze and i swear it's so so good i got this recipe from one of carly bibles what i eat in the days and this might sound weird but i love like finding recipes from people that are not like food bloggers but they are like plant-based because it's not like a difficult fancy recipe it's just like a simple thing so yeah that's where i found it i love watching her begin what i eat in the days so yeah, I'm just gonna eat really quick and then I'll update you when I go to the store. Mm. I'm at Starbucks and I'm trying a new drink. I'm about to pay, so stay tuned. Okay, so the new Starbucks drink. Here it is. So my friend Christine and I have the exact same taste in Starbucks drinks. We used to work at Ulta together and we would always get coffee like multiple times a day. And then we like became best friends when we meet for coffee when we didn't work together anymore. So we're passionate. And she texted me today and said, you need to try this new order that I've been getting. It's $3.45 and it's the same thing as a shaken espresso. It is a 
Doppio Espresso Double with oat milk and white mocha, two pumps. $3.45 and it tastes just like a double shot on ice that used to be and now it's called a shaken espresso and it's so good it's the exact same thing so good nice and strong and the only difference i'm pretty sure is that it's not shaken so really good she said to get a triple i just got a double this time because it's like five almost and seriously it's so good so save your money stop getting a shaken espresso and start getting a doppio which i did not order that they typed that in I just said um, an iced double espresso. That's what I said. So say that. Sorry for using the fancy word. I don't know why I acted like that's what I ordered. But it's so good. And yeah, the oat milk, it's just delicious. Um, but yeah, as you can see, I got ready. Um, I'm gonna take some photos. I'll show you my outfit once I get there. Um, I'm behind a garbage truck right now, so. Everyone is passing me. So yeah, I'm gonna take my photos and then go to the store and then come home and hang out with Bradley. He gets his COVID booster today, so hopefully he doesn't feel sick or anything. We'll keep you updated on how he feels afterwards. Okay, see you at the location. Okay, I just got here. I get my gloss. This is the NARS Orgasm to Infused Lip Oil. It's like my favorite. I'm scraping it off the sides. I need to just buy a new one, but I don't want to. I find it hard spending $30 on a lip gloss. But this has lasted me years. See, look at that. Mm, so pretty. My fave. And it doesn't feel sticky. Okay, so here we are. I'm going to be shooting on that wall back there. It's just like a white wall and the sun is like perfect right now. So we're going to get to it. Oh, it's like bright. Okay, we are all done shooting. I think I got stuff, honestly. When it's sunny like that, like, the photos usually turn out really good, but I can't see them until I, like, get home because, like, my eyesight is so, like, I don't know, I can't look at a screen accurately right now. Um, but anyways, I'm headed to the store, and then I'm going to go home and see Bradley. I think I already said this, like, I'm being redundant at this point, so I'll just see you when I see you. I just got home. I'm making dinner now. I'm making um, just like rigatoni with vodka sauce. Literally just like so basic. Um, but I've never tried the Target brand vodka sauce before and it's so delicious. It's like $2 and I usually get like ones that are plant-based at fresh time and they're like $10 and they're like fine. But this one's just so good. It's not plant-based but it can't have that much dairy in it. So it's it's fine um and I also I didn't do a grocery haul because we just got like staples but I did I ran out of bronzer of my mac bronzer that I always use and I you guys know I can't live without bronzer I used like a dark foundation and cream contour today but I picked up this wet and wild bronzer it's what color is it ticket to Brazil and I thought it looked really pretty so I don't know, I'm gonna try it and I'll let you guys know if it's good. I'm just gonna make dinner and we're probably gonna watch a Christmas movie and just hang out. Hi, Sadie girl. I can't wait to make my bed and like get in bed though. So excited. Bradley just got home a little bit ago. He had his booster today. I think I told you guys that already. How was it? It was good. I just uh, walked right in, I had an appointment and I waited for a couple minutes and then they just gave me a shot. That was it. Is it toxic that I want you not to feel good so I can take care of you? No, I like when you take care of me. It's fun. I'm I just so want sick. you to be sick <laughs> all the time. Just kidding. You look so cute today. Thank you. Look at Brad's hair. He hasn't been on my channel in a while. Do a little... Oh, yeah. Do one of those. 
I haven't had a real haircut since February. It's my last one, and it is November right now. <laughs> you had to of, check your phone? Of, middle of November is what I was looking for. Yeah, I had a little trim in June before, a couple weeks before the wedding, but we're letting it grow. It's so cute. Thank you. I love it. I do too. It's good. Yeah. If not now, when? Never. Right? Mm-hmm. Let's grow it out. Okay. What Hold do you on. think? Hold on, I'm on camera. Spring. Come have a seat at the table. She <laughs> looks like she really loves that. <gasps> you are so beautiful. You look adorable. <laughs> the foot. <laughs> she hates it. What you doing? But you're cute. Good boy. We need to get new flowers. Those are hit. Christmas with my black trees. Oh yeah, Brad did paint those. Okay, love you. We have fresh sheets, fresh duvet, fresh everything. Oh, I cannot wait to go to bed. So with that being said, I'm going to end this vlog right here. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.